Hey guys, it's Tyler. I have been seeing all over Instagram, over YouTube, about this hair paint wax and how it changes your hair color instantly. I went online and I did some shopping and I got me some hair paint wax. So they have tons of colors. They have like blue, pink, orange, yellow, green, like all colors. And I got blonde or like gold, but all of the other colors were like sold out. So I went on Amazon. So I was like, ooh, I wanna get like an orange color cause I really want my hair to be like bright. I ordered from somewhere in China. And as you can see, I ordered the color orange. They sent me, this is not orange, this is gold. So I went back on the hair paint wax website like a week later and they had orange so I got the orange that I got that I wanted and it basically looks like that on the inside. To me, it kind of smells like men's cologne. Like it doesn't it doesn't smell bad. And so my hair is looking like super crazy. So I'm just going to do a quick routine. I'm going to use my kinky curly not today leave-in conditioner. This has been like my fave leave-in conditioner. This one and the as I am leave-in conditioner, those two leave-ins for the summer. These have been like, Mwah. and then I'm also going to use my Diva Curl Ultra Defining Gel. I haven't used this gel in a really hot minute, maybe since like last year, but this gel is very, very expensive. So I'm going to use these two to do my routine. And then once it's time to put the hair paint wax in my hair, I will come back to you guys. So I'm done styling my hair. So now we can get into the fun part. So I'm just going to take my little hair tie really quick and I'm going to section off my hair. So now we're gonna take some of the orange. I'm just gonna take about that much on my finger, not too much, and I'm gonna rub it in like that. And it spreads, if you guys can see that. Ooh. I feel like I might need more my hair is so dark, I may need a little bit more. It's not doing anything. Maybe I need like a little bit more. Okay, it's showing up a little bit. how it's looking it's not like as bright and vibrant as I thought it was gonna be like I thought it was gonna be a lot more like like vibrant like the color was gonna like really pop in my hair but I guess not I'm gonna take a little bit more and I'm just gonna do it like this I wish I had gloves like what the heck I didn't think this through y'all It's starting to show up though. So now I'm going to take down another section of my hair. I'm gonna take a little bit more. I was very light handed with it, but I feel like you need to like really like get it in there. Like as you can see, like my hands are like covered with the orange. So yeah, it, it's, it's coming up now. So I guess you just have to be like, a little heavy handed with it. I didn't want to be too heavy handed with it because I didn't really want it to like weigh my hair down, but we shall see what the results will be like once it dries. I'm really excited to see what this is gonna look like. The 
This is so cool. I'm getting excited now because I can't wait for it to dry but my hair takes like forever to dry but oh my god this is gonna do y'all see this I'm really glad that I did my hair routine first and then put the wax on after so yeah, I'm just going to leave like that part of my hair black. And if y'all were to see me like in real life, my hair's not even black. It's very, very, it's like a light red in real life. It just looks dark on camera. But yeah, ooh. And I feel like it kind of goes with like my skin tone a little bit. I just hope that I don't look like a clown with this in my head. Oh my God. <laughs> I look weird. I look weird. See, this is why hair paint wax is coming in clutch because had I did this permanently, I would have been like, oh my God. I would have been crying. I would have been like, what the freak did I just do to my hair? Cause right now that is my reaction. Like what did I just do to my hair? But this is not permanent. so. It's all good. I can wash this right out if it looks crazy, but I'm just gonna keep applying it because I'm sure you guys want to see the final results just as bad as I do. Yeah. And if you're gonna try this, I would make sure that you have like a towel like present because this can like stain your carpet and your clothes. And so just make sure you're prepared when you're like doing this but yeah i'm going to just make sure every part of the hair is like coated and those are just like the roots that are still black but oh my gosh okay wow okay this is what it would look like if i had like lighter hair Hmm, I don't know how I feel about it. So, I feel like I should try a little bit of this blonde, this gold. I keep saying blonde, it's gold. I'm just gonna do like, like certain pieces. So I just put like a few little highlights in my hair using the gold and I don't want to use too much of it because I don't know like how it's going to look. So I'm just going to add just a few little pieces on this side of my hair so that they're gold. Hopefully this doesn't like take forever to dry. This is actually really fun to do. I feel like a kid again. Okay, so I'm done putting the gold in my hair. So far, I feel like it looks pretty, pretty good. I'll get up close so that you guys can see what it is looking like, up close and personal. So I'm going to let my hair air dry. Well, I'm actually gonna sit in front of the fan for 
two, three hours. Right now it is one o'clock. So I'm gonna let my hair dry. And once we are all dry, I will come back to you guys with the final results. So stay tuned. Much, much, much later. <laughs> It's three o'clock, so that only took like two, two hours. So not that bad, but you guys, this color. <laughs> in person, on camera, it looks good on camera. In person, I look so weird, I feel. I feel like I look so weird with lighter hair. As you can see, my hair is like super, super defined. My hair does feel very heavy, but I guess that is expected when you're using like a wax. And my hair is also very, very crispy. Like it's, it's a little, it's a little crisp. So this is going to be interesting because I actually have somewhere to be after I film this video. So yeah, I can't wait to see people's reaction to my hair. So I tried to separate as many curls as I could, but I think this is good enough. I'm not gonna lie, my hair does feel very, very dry. Like it doesn't feel moisturized, it doesn't feel soft. My hair feels like it has like some type of wax or some type of something on it. It doesn't feel like super soft, but the residue on my hands is like barely anything. But yeah, these are the results. As I keep looking at it, it looked, it's starting to look decent. Like, it's not as bad as, as I thought it was gonna be. So, how do we feel about Tyler with lighter hair? Leave a comment in the comment section below and let me know. What do you think about color on me? But the one thing that I really do like about having lighter hair is that you can see the definition in my hair a lot better than when it's like my dark hair. Like you can see the definition clear as day. I think that's the only thing about lighter hair that I like. That's like the one thing I do like about this. And um, yeah, I like, this is like a nice like summer, like summer look. Like in the summertime, if you wanna like brighten up your hair, this is really cool. So because I'm extra, I want to do a hair montage of this hair because I feel like it deserves it. So cue the montage.
as I keep looking at my hair, I'm kind of loving the lighter hair on me. This was a really good product to try out. I don't know if I could ever fully commit to going like this light, but I did have fun making the video. So I will leave links down in the description box if you guys want to try out this product for yourselves. So if you like this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'll see you guys all in my next one. Bye.